Hey, here's what you need to know. Next week is all about getting your feet a little wet in living a life for God. Literally. Baptism is the outward sign of a life that has been changed on the inside by Jesus Christ. If you've never publicly declared that you've been made free by God, next week is your opportunity. There's a freshness about everything. Like the, the first breath you take is kind of like, it's a new breath. It's, it's nice. It was really just a fresh start for me. I grew up in church and honestly, I've had an easy life until this year. And my family's been faced with more than I ever thought that we would be faced with. And God's the only thing that's got me through this and I've given it to him. And I just wanted to give my life to him and have a fresh start. I felt a sense of security, a sense of awesomeness. It's, I can't stop smiling. I've been smiling ever since. It's just an awesome feeling that just, just can't be described. Over the next couple of weeks, the theme of our messages will be around the idea of my messy life. Hey, my man. You know what you want to do right now? You want to do a video. What's the video about? Come on, get in here. Yeah, I'll show you. Come on. All right, sit in. All right. So, I'm going to have you answer that question. Okay? Into that camera. Then answer that question into that camera. Okay. You cool? All right. Just look in the camera and then oh, swipe over, okay? There. Yeah. You You're gonna do great. Wait, I, I don't know about this. <laughs> Life is messy. From the dishes in the sink to our everyday relationships, things can often seem less than perfect. Most of the time, there are many areas in our lives that we wish we could clean up. So that brings us to our first question. When you hear the term messy life, what do you think about and why? Messy life. Messy life is the stress and the chaos and work and sometimes even family. When I think about the term messy life, I think about imperfect relationships. I think about my messy house with dirty laundry. That you were dealt a bad hand on the organization. Messy life. Mess is like when you're always doing something and you're always doing it wrong. I think of a life that is so disorganized and so turned around that you can't really focus on the things that are important. If you had 24 hours left to live and you could clean up any mess in your own life, what mess would that be? If I could fix one thing, it would probably be the relationships that I may or may not have ruined in my past. Relationships. Relationships. My relationship with my parents. Bringing my family closer to Jesus. I would clean up my sisters and my brothers. All of us come together as one family. The things that go on in my head and what I think I need to do to be perfect. If there was one mess I could clean up, it would be a mindset that I'm irrelevant. I don't matter. Something I still struggle with. We all deal with messes. Join us for My Messy Life, a chance to find out how God intends for us to deal with our messes and move from a life of drama to a life of purpose. You can sign up for baptism at freedomhouse.cc slash baptism. Join us next week for our new series, My Messy Life. Never miss out on a thing and get all our free content at freedomhouse.cc slash this week. Have a great day.